So if you're watching this video, I'm assuming you also had a little bit of trouble understanding Bitwig Studio's upgrade plan. On the main page, when it says, renew your upgrade plan for another 12 months, um, and you get one, uh, 12 months of free upgrades, it sounds like a subscription status. But if you go to their FAQ page that talks about the 12 months, 12 months of free upgrades, it's best answered in these questions here. So uh, let's see, can I continue using the software when my upgrade plan expires? Yes, you can, it's not a subscription. You own the perpetual license, but the upgrade plan is only required if you want access to the latest version. After the 12 month period, that comes with your initial purchase has expired. That was weird the way I worded that last part. So it's not a subscription, but you get 12 months of free upgrades to the next version of Bitwig, whatever that may be. Uh, that's a pretty good deal in my opinion. Uh, I know there's certain companies like Steinberg, they've released their updates um, you know, fresh off the the market, some usually in December or something. And uh, what they'll do is they'll backdate roughly about three months prior to there. They will give a free upgrade to people who purchased the previous version of Cubase. They'll give a free version to them within that like three month window or whatever it is. Uh, this is kind of the same thing but it's a preemptive way of telling the customer, hey, buy Bitwig and we'll give you 12 months of guaranteed upgrades. Post video shout out to all the people using Bitwig. I have had Bitwig 1 for a while and am now upgraded to version 2 and I'm using Bitwig as my main music production software to start all my songs, to build the arrangements, and to make all the mix downs. And then I think um, it's going to be that way for quite some time. Because I do like the workflow uh, that comes with it. It's been uh, pretty good so far. Um, yeah. So thanks for watching. Hopefully that explains things. And take care. Bye-bye.